That dog has had way too many complaints. Lock that dog up. A dog seized by animal control after attacking two children in Ottawa County. Tonight, a nine-year-old girl is recovering after needing more than 100 stitches to repair her eye and cheek. An 11-year-old boy suffered bites to his thigh and arm. Target 8 investigator Susan Samples reports the victim's family says the dog, described as a pit bull, had wandered loose before. This is where it all happened here at Leisure Estates off Butternut. It was shortly before 5 o'clock on Wednesday. Several kids were playing in an inflatable pool when a dog from across the street wandered over. This is Draco the dog last winter wandering onto the porch of a neighbor who snapped this picture and complained to management at Leisure Estates. Lock that dog up. Neighbors say this is Draco's owner surrendering the dog to animal control Wednesday night after it bit two children, including 11-year-old Dominic Morales. You got me right here. Dominic had been playing in the pool with his sisters and a friend, nine-year-old Allison. Allison, uh, she tried telling him to go home. She fell on the floor, and that's when he started to, uh, to bite her. Um, I was able to pull her off of her, but... Then he started to bite me. I was able to get him by the collar. Dominic's stepmom was able to get the dog off him. Allison's grandma, who lives next door, is grateful the 11 year old jumped into action. Dominic saved my granddaughter. He's a blessing. Allison needed more than 100 stitches and likely surgery to repair her eyelid. Nothing was done with this dog. Dominic's stepmom says Leisure Estates failed to take action after her prior complaints about the loose dog. We tried to ask the managers ourselves. The residents are saying they've complained about the dog before. Yeah, and I, like I say, I can't answer anything right now because it all has to go through my corporate office. Can't tell me what you guys did about these complaints about the dog. No, I can't. That dog has had way too many complaints and that dog should have been gone a long, long time ago. The Sheriff's Department is investigating how this happened and will work with the prosecutor to determine if criminal charges are warranted. The dog was seized by Ottawa County Animal Control. No word on what its fate will be just yet. In Holland Township, Susan Samples, News 8. Leisure Estates just sent us a statement saying that they're taking legal action against the dog's owner. The park said animals have to be on handheld leashes on their own property or risk being picked up by animal control.